Hey, what is up guys? Jeremy here and welcome back to another video. I'm going to be showing you guys how to get Lock Plus on iOS 9.3.3. Now this is a bit of a process, so I'll be taking you through it step by step. Uh, also, I will have it all down in the description. So if you guys forget, you know, halfway through of this tutorial, just remember that I have all of the steps listed down in the description as well. So uh, the first thing you're going to want to do is jump into Cydia and we will have a few things we need to download from here. The first being lock HTML4. Uh, this is a paid tweak as you guys can see. It's uh, it's $1. I would recommend to get this legit paid version just because the pirated versions do have the possibility of putting your device into a boot loop. So like I said, I would recommend getting the, le the legit version here, the paid version. The next thing you will need is SciCrypt, as you guys can see how to spell it there. So just go ahead and search in Cydia for SciCrypt. Go ahead and, and uh, install that on your device as well. The next thing you're going to need is iFile. So go ahead and search for iFile. Go ahead and install that on your device as well. So now you have installed those three packages, what you're going to want to do is go into Safari and go ahead and go to uh, this Dropbox uh, page right here. As you can see, it's called Web SciCrypt. Now there is a Web SciCrypt within Cydia, but it's not yet updated. Uh, so this is the updated version. So you're gonna have to download it separate from Cydia. So like I said, go to this Dropbox page here. The, the link for this will be down in the description and you're gonna wanna click on the download button in the upper right there. So go ahead and click on that and then click on direct download. Give it a second to load here. And then what you're gonna to wanna to do is click on open in iFile. So this is why we need an iFile. Just go ahead and click on open in iFile. And then you're gonna to wanna to click on installer. So go ahead and install it on your device. I'm, I've already done it, so I'm not gonna do it. Now, once you're done installing web SciCrypt, we're gonna jump back into Cydia. The next package you're gonna need is infostats2. So just go ahead and search this up and install it on your device. And now the final package you will need is lock plus for lock HTML. This is from a paid repo within Cydia. You will have to pay for the repo in order to get the package. So you will get lock plus and then you also get a whole bunch of other stuff if you do buy uh, the repo. I did a previous video on the repo. It's called the, the super secret repo. If you guys wanna you know, see how to get more in depth with that check out that video otherwise uh, just go ahead and swipe down here and you will have to purchase this repo like I said I'll have the repo down in the description uh, also this is a $10 repo but if you use the coupon code iDeviceMovies you will get that 50% off so it'll be five bucks uh, for the repo access which is well worth it I think that lock plus is definitely worth five dollars uh, so like I said if you have any issues with um, purchasing you know this repo check out my previous video i'll leave the video link for it and i'll also leave the links everything you'll need to be in the description in order to get this so uh, once you've done that just go ahead and install lock plus for lock html and then once your device is done respringing you are set to get lock plus working so the first thing we're going to do is jump into the settings here and then we're going to go to uh, lock html4 so this was the first thing we downloaded Make sure you enable it with the switch at the top there. So turn it on. And then what you're gonna to wanna to do is select widget and go ahead and select on lock plus and then click on reorder and make sure that if there's anything else enabled that lock plus is at the very top. So once you've done that, you can back out. And the next thing you want to edit is the widget position. So go ahead and click the above notifications option right there. Uh, and that's basically all you gotta do and then you can uh, basically just respring your device and we can go to my lock screen here really quickly and you should have lock plus up and running so if we swipe over from the side here is lock plus so we can go ahead and go through some of the themes that i do have installed just swipe up on it and it will instantly change to that theme for your lock screen so that is basically how you get lock plus working for ios 9.3.3 again like i said all of the steps and everything i mentioned is down in the description so if you guys at all get confused, be sure to check out the description. Everything is listed there. But anyways, hope this tutorial helped you guys out. If it did, definitely throw me a thumbs up. That helps me out a lot here at the channel. And if you guys wanna see more videos like this in the future, don't forget to click that subscribe button. This has been Jeremy, and I will catch you guys in the next one. Later.